Imagine having your car illegally parked, but it still gets ticketed and then towed and then sold for scrap. That's exactly what some people say the city of Wilmington is doing. Matt Petrillo is covering the story for us. Amira Shahid says Wilmington ticketed her legally parked car six times in nine days. Over and over again, I came to the city building to contest the tickets, to fight the tickets. They did nothing. And it took almost four months to get a court hearing, she says, but by then, it was too late. My car was already scrapped. Scrapped, her attorney says, by first state towing. All of this is outrageous, but what's even more outrageous? Is the city did not even credit the value of that car towards her parking tickets. So even today, the city is still coming after her. I am still confused. Confused, says Earl Dickerson, because he also parked his vehicle legally in Wilmington, but says it was ticketed and then towed, and after 30 days, scrapped, he says, but this time by city towing services. It was my only means of transportation. And it was the center of my family. And they took that away. And they took a part of me away. When the people's cars are towed, if they owe money to the city, well, then that's something that they could take up to the city. We went to city towing looking for answers. Why scrap these cars as the attorney alleges so quickly? Well, the, the law is 30 days. Nobody should lose their car because of a few parking tickets. And that attorney filed a federal lawsuit Wednesday. Meantime, the city of Wilmington and First Day Towing had no comment. In Wilmington, Matt Petrillo, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.